and to remember the uh, Hampton Inn Belfast City Centre here in Northern Ireland, UK. And this is a Queen Family Room 810. And you don't often find me staying in Hampton Inn Hotels. And I believe the last one was in Cuyaquil in Ecuador a few years ago. And a there are quite a few different versions of this. Um, and this, I mean, this is fine, but looks extremely generic and could be basically anywhere. Um, so here's the bathroom. So you have towels, toilet, um, these um, pump bottles for hand soap and body lotion some paper and here we have the uh, or tissue actually and here we have the shower the modular shower combo and of course you have these fun bottles here as well um, and what I was saying about very something very generic is that I mean literally this could be anywhere and this is <laughs> this is quite a space a miracle so the door to the bathroom if you close that it reveals this um, small closet with ironing board and iron and extra blanket and uh, here's the room itself so this could be in my opinion any select service hotel um, nothing nothing extra ordinary about this I would say so here we have the uh, the bed the sofa which I'm sure you can turn to a, a bed because this is a family room a work desk TV tea and coffee so um, you tend to get what you pay for, but the problem nowadays is that all these hotels are pretty dynamically priced. So even even something like this, meaning basic Hampton Inn, can uh, cost an arm and leg, um, depending on the dynamic um, hotel occupancy rates. So priced basically dynamically, but again completely fine. If the price is right, and this was the Hampton Inn, Belfast City Centre, and this is the Queen Family Room 810.